Hello, hello everyone. Welcome back to the 100 day challenge on MATLAB loop. So the task for today is Pascal triangle. Okay. So for this only we were uh, trying for the last three days. Okay. So we just uh, created a matrix. I mean, uh, we just uh, given a vector input. Okay. And, and we have just uh, tried how to add two, two elements in the vector, right? So how to add two, two elements in the vector. And then we just repeated that process for the four times in this trial add loop function okay and yesterday we what we did is we just like uh, created a triangle okay so where the number triangle pattern with number okay so first uh, row of the triangle has one then one two then one two three this was the triangle which we created yesterday okay so this pascal triangle is nothing but if you see this is one okay so the first entry will be always one in the Pascal triangle. That is the first row for only one entry. It will be always one. Okay. So now you just add zero and zero here. Okay. In the highlighted area. So you have to add in the left and right side. You have to add zeros. Okay. So after adding zeros, you have to add zero plus one is one. So that is what here. Then again, one plus zero is one. Right. So that is what here. Now comes to the second line okay so now you just add one zero on the left and one zero on the right okay now add so zero plus one is one okay and one plus one is two and one plus zero is one correct that is what here okay and again add zero and zero in the right left and right okay now again add it here par by pairing like zero and one is one one and two is three two and one is three one and zero is one because i mean uh, while adding and shifting to the next row you have to just imagine you have some another i mean two zero one at the start and uh, uh, one at the uh, end okay and you have to pair it up and add okay so that is what what i have done is like i have just uh, given you training for how to add a vector uh, i mean how to add elements in the vector by pairing up and also how to do it again and again inside a loop and also how to just create a, a triangle okay and what i have done is i have just just see here just i mean merge the program so till here this is the same code okay so except that i have just uh, uh, we yesterday we printed by incrementing the num and uh, we have just uh, printed the num okay here the num acts as a uh, vector okay this vector size keeps on increasing for each iteration okay so here is what uh, here is what we just added and uh, we created to this a uh, new uh, row uh, which means see here this is the first row okay so usually one will be usually in the num okay so once it finished that particular loop this num get cleared and uh, so after the process after the process here see here after uh, after the process here now num holds two values that is one and one okay and once the process is done the num holds uh, three values one two one okay so uh, here interesting fact is like i have just created a new vector okay so new vector is nothing but the first element in the new vector is a zero c zero app that is zero appending so i have just added one two zeros okay one uh, zero will be in the first and another zero will be in the end and in the middle i have just uh, just fixed the num okay whatever in, if it is a first row then uh, only one will be here if it is a second row two two numbers will be there if it is a third row three numbers will be there okay so i have just created this new vector and then paired up and added that's it and again it goes there and it prints and comes here so this is what the pascal triangle is there are so many ways to create a pascal triangle you can just use it factorial method to create a fact uh, pascal triangle but here i have just used just a loop to create a pascal triangle okay I guess, uh, you, I mean, you you'll have uh, no doubt on this topic. If you have any doubt, do let me know in the comment section. I'm ready to answer your queries. Okay, so I let me run uh, this program for you. Just giving a, a ten rows. So if you give ten rows, you will get the Pascal triangle till nine. Okay, so if you just give eleven, you'll get till ten. Okay, so see here. So you have to add the elements by pairing up here okay so provided you have to add zero one in the left and one in the right okay okay i hope you understand this topic again i'm saying if you have any doubt do let me know in the sec uh, comment section i'm ready to answer your queries okay so that's all for this particular video we'll meet you in the next session till then take care bye bye